What's up guys, it's Polip here and welcome back to another video. Today we are doing some more quizzes and the first one is, how dirty is your mind? Well, I regard myself as a child of God and I have no dirty habits. I am a very good boy, but it's up to the this quiz to decide and um, damn, do you see anything unusual in this Christmas, Matt? Well... Let's just say if my grandma saw this, she would probably have a heart attack. Because it does look like a penis. So, yes, I do. Uh, do you see anything naughty in the newspaper graphic? I mean, not really. I guess this is supposed to kind of look like a penis, but it, it just looks like a thermometer. So, no. Oh, that's that's an unfortunate birthmark. He um uh he's gonna need some therapy. Maybe a skin graft because this this is an unfortunate birthmark. Oh Jesus, is there anything funny to you about this mushroom? Um They wouldn't serve that at the church buffet, I, I can tell you that. It does look a bit suspicious. It would definitely get voted off if we were playing Among Us. Does the back of this office chair make you do a double take? Um, I can see why it does look a bit phallic, but... I mean, at the end of the day, it is a chair, and from a different angle it would probably look normal, so no. See anything X-rated in this latte art? Now, th this could be a sign. See, I've seen the people in Costa do the <laughs> in the coffee, and if I got this from my local barista, um, I would be asking some questions. Maybe I would also get a restraining order. Just saying. Does the shadow of a foot seem a little dirty to you? No, it looks like a foot. Do these tropical plants uh, resemble anything specific to you? Yes, that fucking, the bell, what's that Pokemon called? The yellow one, the bell, bell sprout? I can't remember, but it just looks like that. Does this ice in this water bottle seem oddly familiar? Um, no, kind of just looks like a mushroom. Oh, whoa, this, uh, <clears throat> that's a big one. You can make quite a few chips out of that one. All right. Only moderately dirty minded. You score. Uh, you, you scored better than twenty four percent of quiz takers. Well, there's not as many dirty bastards out here as I thought. But anyway, on to the next quiz. All right, now this quiz: How sexy are you on a scale of one to ten? Now I already know I am a fifteen. But we're just going to see if this quiz can can make me feel a little bit better about myself. Now, the first question. When you look in the mirror, what is your first thought? Hey there, gorgeous. I need a spa day. My paws are gigantic. Or damn, not in a good way. Um, uh, I need a spa day. I haven't had a good spa day in a long time. So I do need a spa day. Now. What do you think is your best physical feature? My butt, my legs, other, my abs, my eyes. Um, I think I have a pretty nice butt. I think I'm going to choose my butt. Uh, which of these celebrities would you hang out with? Henry Cavill, Michael B. Jordan, Riz Ahmed, or Tom Holland? I don't know who Riz is. Um... 
I would have to say Henry Cavill just because he plays Geralt in The Witcher, and that's like one of my favorite games. So I'm going to say Henry Cavill. I'm sure all of them are cool guys. I'm just not sure who this one is. What's your favorite first date question? Um, is this like the first question? It's like, what do you like for breakfast? Okay, if someone asks what your zodiac 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 sign is, they can fuck off right away. I don't care if you're a Cancer, a Libra, fucking Leprechaun. I don't give a shit. Tell me about your family. No, you don't want to hear about whose uncle is sleeping with whose dad. Fuck that. What's your favorite book? Nah, that's boring. What's your favorite breakfast food? Damn, Adobe's been putting in money for these ads. How would you treat yourself? I would have spa day, I would go shopping, I would go to a party with friends, I would travel. Well, you can't travel now, the lockdown, can't go to a party with friends. I would say I would have spa day at home by myself with no contact to anybody else. Now, how would you describe your style? Sexy, casual, chic or hipster? I would say casual. Yeah, just casual. How much makeup do you wear? Hmm. As you can see, I'm working with a lot of face. So, a, f a full face. I do the blush, the, the, the other one that goes on your eyes. All of them. Now, how long does it take to get ready in the morning? Two hours, one hour. It depends on where I'm going, or 30 minutes. Um... It depends on where I'm going, if I have to dress up nice. Uh, yeah, it depends. Uh, which of these online stores would you go shopping on? House of CB, uh, I'm not sure what that is. Fashion Nova, I'm not really sure what that is. ASOS, I'm too poor for that, so we'll go with Amazon. Now... Which of these would you use to describe yourself? Gorgeous, hot, cute, pretty. Um, I would say I'm pretty cute. I've got a big squishy face. I think I'm pretty cute. Do you find people intimidating? Um, see, I'm quite socially awkward. Uh, and It depends. I usually find men more intimidating than women. Um... But yeah, it, it depends, really. So what is the reaction of other people when you walk down the street? They cat call me, they try and talk to me, they turn their heads, they don't do anything. I mean, they don't do anything if I walk down the street. I've never walked down the street and then have people turn their heads. I've never been cat called and they don't try and talk to me if they're my friends, so usually they just don't do anything. Have you been asked out by many people? No. Next question. How would you like to be asked out? Um, in person, with flowers, via text. It doesn't matter to me. I would say in person. Flowers is a bit too much. Via text is a bit of a, like, it's a bit wimpy. And, yeah, I would say in person. Where would you like to be taken on a date? To a fine dining restaurant, to the movies, amusement park, or to a concert. Not a Broadway show. I've never been to a concert. Hmm. Not fine dining because that's... You have to get dressed up, you have to like wash your asshole, you have to do all these different things. I think to the movies. I'm not a massive fan of amusement parks. I don't particularly like all the roller coasters and shit. Uh, do you think that you look better than your last boyfriend slash girlfriend? Um, hmm. Of course I did. Yes, we're equal. He slash she was better looking. Um, we were probably pretty equal. And then on a scale of 1 to 10, how confident are you? 4. I'm not a very confident person, unfortunately. I would like to be like a, a 6 or an 8. I wouldn't like to be a 10 because then you come off as a prick. How many partners have you had? 31 plus. Fuck no. Who has 31 partners? 20 to 30. 
uh, one to ten like normal people? Who the fuck has thirty one part plus partners? <sighs> Are you the most attractive person in your friend group? Yes, I think so. I'm not sure. No, um, no. Well, I'm not sure. I don't know. It's up to the other people. Do you care what people say about you? Yes. I shouldn't, but I do. No, it depends on who the person is sometimes. I do. I do care, unfortunately. Do you work out? No. I want to, and I used to, but recently I have not been working out. How many fucking questions are there? Jesus. Which of these perfumes would be your signature scent? That one, Lacombe La V.S. Belle, Victor and Rolf, Flower Bomb, Mark Jacobs, Daisy, Ooh, So Fresh. F fuck knows, go for Rolf. Rolf Harris. Actually, oh no, you don't want to smell like him. Which of these sexy songs do you like? I'm too sexy. I'm sexy and I know it. You sexy thing, sexy back. Hmm. I like some Timbaland, I would say uh, Sexy Back's a good one. Would you ever get work done? W would you ever, what, what does this mean? Would you ever get work done? Yes. I don't, like work work or like work? Yes, I guess. Which of these places would you visit? Miami, Florida, Las Vegas, Nevada, Los Angeles, New York. I've always wanted to go to Miami. Uh, well, I've always wanted to go to Florida. I, I would say actually California, Los Angeles. I do also want to go to Florida. And how do you spend your weekends? Going out on dates, relaxing, doing chores, watching TV and movies. Right now, watching TV and movies because we're not allowed out. What do you like to do for fun? Hang out with friends, go shopping, travel, visit museums and galleries. Hmm. Actually, um, I like to uh, get in my car and drive into shops, but apparently this that's not an option. So I like to hang out with my friends. Sometimes we drive into places together. Uh, what kind of party would you throw for your next birthday? Costume party, a pool party, a karaoke party, a dinner party. Hmm. None of these. I mean, I don't have a pool. I don't have a karaoke machine. So I guess costume party, because a dinner party is going to be fucking boring. And, like, you've got the vegetarians, and then you have to mow the grass for them, and it's a pain in the ass. How do you describe your build? Curvy, um, athletic, slim, regular. I'm pretty curvy. Yeah, I would say I'm, I'm curvy. I got that ass. Hmm. Now, which of these sexy emojis do you, you send to people? Eggplant or peach? Tongue out? Dancing woman? Smirking emoji? Um, I guess the tongue out. I I don't send the eggplant emoji unless I'm like, hey. Do you want an eggplant for dinner? But that could be taken the wrong way, actually. So I'm just going to say tongue emoji. Hmm. Six. Well, um. Fuck this. Everyone knows I'm a 15. Fuck you. Also, I do not look like this. Who, who's Yuri? I am not Yuri. Six. <laughs> Fucking six. Everyone knows I am a 15. The most important part is I know I'm a 15. Fuck this BuzzFeed. It's not even BuzzFeed. It's how stuff works. Fuck you. Well, anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.